Malaysia is a land of rich biodiversity, home to dazzling array of wildlife, including the majestic Malayan tarpon. And unique animal native to only Southeast Asia, it is a white and black beauty. However, its vitality to the Malaysian ecosystem is being destroyed. There are fewer than 1,500 mature individuals left in the wild, being listed as endangered on the IUCN Red List. But why is this the case? The awareness is lacking. Malayan tarpons are falling into the abyss of misfortune with habitat loss, poaching and roadkill. Habitat loss is the biggest threat to the Malayan tarpon as rainforests are cleared for agriculture development. Tarpons lose their homes and food sources. They have been spotted wandering onto the roads and into communities. Poaching is another major threat. Tuppers are hunted for their meat and often get struck in bear traps meant for other animals. Blood loss slowly takes over, leading to their death. Roadkill is also a very significant problem. Tuppers are often killed by speeding cars as they cross roads in search of food and meat. Difficult to see in the darkness, drivers often pummel into them at high speeds. According to a study conducted by the Department of Wildlife and National Parks Peninsula Malaysia, a total of 115 Malayan tuppers were recorded as roadkill in Peninsula Malaysia from 2006 to 2019. This is deeply grieving. Such a wonderful animal being mercilessly slaughtered by those who are not aware. We need to change this. We need to restore its IUCN status from endangered to least concerned. The humble species will be driven to extinction if we do not take action. To protect the Malayan tupper from extinction, we must work together, from civilians, the governments, to the young generation. Civilians can raise awareness about endangered animals, avoid buying products made from their body parts, and support sustainable living practices. Governments can also stop deforestation, construct wildlife refugees, install more tupper crossing signs, and enforce stricter laws against poaching. And the young generation can learn about endangered animals and participate in awareness programs. By working together, we can make a difference in protecting endangered animals and our planet for future generations. As a part of my contributions to raise global awareness about the Tupper's plight, I have come up with a website, MEAA, which describes about the Tupper and provides a lot of info and a game called SATA which provides a learning experience to the gamers and as well as raising awareness regarding the Malayan tupper. Let us unite to conserve the tuppers.